Development mode is frequently referred to as Dev mode or Developer mode. Under the Develop menu, we can see a toggle to turn Development mode on or off. There are also three tools for developers, as well as a list of projects at the bottom of the menu. Let's go ahead and click the toggle to turn on Development mode. Your Looker data model exists in two states, Production mode and Development mode. Typically, when users explore data in Looker, they're in production mode. In this case, the data model they are exploring is shared across all users. The LookML files that make up the data model are treated as read-only in this mode. Development mode allows us to make and test LookML changes without affecting business users. Let's take a look at a project to see how this works. When in development mode, if a file has changed or is new, then the name of the file will be colored blue, and the editor uses green highlighting to indicate rows that have changed in the file. For example, the user's view has been changed, and the specific lines that have been changed are where we added the age tier dimension. This dimension does not exist yet in production mode. It only exists in our development environment. Let's test the new age tier dimension by navigating to the Customers Explorer. When we open the user's view, we can see the age tier dimension that we just created. Let's also add the age dimension and click Run to test the new field. And now we can see that the tiers are working. Keep in mind that until we push this change to production, the dimension will only be available in development mode. There are two situations that might surprise you. To set up the first situation, let's save this explorer as a look. Let's just save it into our personal folder. Now we have a look that uses the age tier dimension, which, remember, exists only in development mode. If we turn off development mode, then the look will break because it doesn't have access to that field. So if you ever go to an existing look and you see this error message, consider the possibility that the field only exists in your development mode. A second situation that we might see more rarely is that under the Develop tab, we may see additional projects when we are in development mode. This is because those additional projects have not yet been pushed to production. Thanks for watching. In this video, we talked about development mode.